everyone! It is Friday again! Where did this week go? It is January 9th and it's 301 days until Reichstag! This week has been full of work for me. Um, I work 20 hours a week in an office and then I also teach German now. It's fun but it's also a lot of work because I need to prepare all the lessons. And I want to be kind of creative sometimes because I want my students to have fun when they're learning. On Monday I went to uh, Düsseldorf, which was about an hour train right away. And I met up with Dinah Russell, who is working both for the Harry Potter Alliance and the Wispopedia, because I had met her in London at the Yule Ball, and she had mentioned that um, she was in Düsseldorf just to visit the city, and um, she had she suggested that we could meet up, and we did, and it was so much fun. She's such a nice person, and it was very good to hear about how the Harry Potter Alliance works and. Uh, what they are doing and how much fun it is and about the Wikipedia it was just a great great evening I had loads of fun I had really loads of fun um, it was although it was kind of hard to get back because of all the snow and the cold it's pretty much very darn cold you don't want to go out and also I don't need to go out because this week my uh, Harry Potter Wii game arrived and so <laughs> All I'm doing in the evenings now is swish and flick and swish and flick because I'm having serious trouble with Wingardium Leviosa. I don't know what is wrong, but uh, I keep on hitting myself with the stuff I try to to lift. Um, but apart from that, it's so much fun. I keep on running around in Hogwarts and not doing any of the tasks I'm supposed to do because it's just so nice to see all of Hogwarts and it's just loads of fun, although Ron and Hermione are kind of annoying because they always stand in the way, I think. And sometimes Hermione is doing like... <sighs> and, I mean, that's totally Hermione-ish. Hermione-ish. But sometimes you're like, shut up. But yeah, it's, it's, uh, so, it's so much fun. It's so much fun. If you ever get a chance to try it, do so. Um, earlier today I was in the town center to meet up with some friends and I also went to the library where I checked out a few books and I checked out The Secret Life of Bees which Susie said is awesome and so I see when I can read that. I also wanted to get The Book Thief but it was checked out. So. As soon as it comes back, I'm going to get it and I'm going to read it because I also, I'm also open for other suggestions of good books because I don't know what to read really at the moment. So if you know anything, just post it in the comments maybe. It would be nice. Oh, and while I was in town, I also went and donated some blood. Ta -da! That's something I used to do sort of irregularly during the um, last few years. But this year, and that's sort of a belated um, New Year's resolution, I'm planning on do, um, to do it regularly. Like every, I think, six or eight weeks. I don't know how often you can do it. So uh, I'm, I'll do that because it's a really great way to help people, to help save people's lives. Because my mom, for instance, um, my mom's life was saved twice by blood donations. So there were two random people that saved my mom's life. I mean, it's that is such a great thing. And if your um, personal and religious beliefs allow that, please do it. Please go and don donate blood. I'll put a link in the sidebar. I put a link for the um, German Red Cross, and I think the American Red Cross is doing it. I know. I'll see. I put a link over there, anyways. And while I'm at it, um. If you feel like it, if you have thought about such things, 
become an organ donor because it is so important and so many people need organs to survive and I don't want to offend anyone but um, I mean if you're dead you don't need your organs anymore and in Germany there is um, a website I will link to that too and I will, will try to find out how it works in the US in Germany there's a website where you can go to and you fill out this little form and you print it and boom you're an organ donor and you can also say well you can specify whether you want to donate all your organs or just which ones you don't want to or, uh, donate or which ones you do want to or, uh, donate and you can also say no I don't want to donate any organs or you can have even have somebody um, decide after you are dead so you can put that all in there and it's so easy to save a life okay <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry I didn't mean to sort of advertise that kind of thing so much but it's really important to me and you should all go do it um, okay oh I want to give a little shout out to my very 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 good mother friend Tina who not only knows about this project but who also knows that my turn is Friday she knows it it's so awesome hi Tina um, yes and she ooh, I think I think I'm actually converting her into a Harry Potter fan sort of or at least a person who likes Harry Potter because um, there are three like hints because number one is she borrowed the first book from me and number two she bought the DVD set like the whole thing which comes oh it is so nice which comes in a little box that looks like a trunk and um, the DVDs are packed differently so they look like little books it's so, it's so nice I want to have it too and number three whenever we meet and play the guitar to the guitar together uh, obviously all I can play is wizard rock so she has asked me to learn a few songs I mean how awesome is that it's just it's so great I yeah I keep on working on it uh, okay and before I forget, uh, today is also Severus Snape's birthday. Okay. And it's One Piece birthday as well. So happy birthday! Yay! Okay. Enough for today. Uh, Matt, I will see you tomorrow.